very complex of course in terms of the speed which was there usually uh, we have been rigging the Bamo 12 and the 10th year and uh, what we realized that in the 15 uh, the most important thing is that the speed is uh, well blended I mean like uh, for someone who loves speed uh, that's not something what I look for when I buy a BT whiskey but it was very well balanced I've been to Scotland for two trips I've been to Bomo on the Isla, I loved it and I've, I've had the 10, the 12 but 15 finally being available in India, I'm truly happy and gratified. Love the Bomo 15, I think I uh, love the dampness in it, the oiliness uh, of the whiskey stayed in my palate for a very long time. I really love the complexity of the fruits. From a palate perspective, uh, I didn't really feel the peat on the nose initially, but on the palate it was very prominent. So a must uh, do for people who love peat and the complexity of a smooth and nice ripe whiskey.